Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Brandon with the Volsung Training Group here today to talk to you about a silencer I recently got in. This is the Dead Air Mask HD. This is a 22 cal can. I'll be testing this out with different types of ammunition, subsonic and standard ammunition, and different platforms. Uh, the platforms we'll be using today is the SIG P322. This is the 22 caliber SIG. Uh, it is a direct mount in essence. There is a thread protector you need to take off. They do su supply uh, the correct adapter for this if you purchase this through SIG. So you swap off the old one, put the new one on, and as you can see, it just direct threads on there. The other platform we'll be testing today is the Ruger 1022 takedown. This comes with a pre-threaded barrel as well. You just take the thread protector off. And direct thread the can onto the barrel. And there you go. All set up, ready to go. So let's go outside and test these things out. I do have a sound level meter on my phone that I'll be testing with an external microphone. It may not be exactly accurate as far as the dB ratings we get, but it'll be close enough and we'll at least be able to test the reduction in sound based on what the factory specs are with both of these platforms. So let's head outside and see what we get. Hey guys, it's Brandon with Volsung Training Group here with Tom from Rooftop Complex. Uh, this is our first series of tests here. This will be the 1022 Ruger, the takedown, takedown backpacker version. I'm gonna shoot five rounds of Wildcat ammo, 22 LR, without the suppressor, just to get a baseline reading. Uh, we have the phone here set up with the sound level meter app running, just to get a good idea of kind of what the baseline is for this. Thing of note, uh, if you do have a dead air mask, it says in the directions of it not to shoot Wildcat ammo through the suppressor. It will void the warranty. So with that being said, we're not going to shoot the Wildcat ammo through the suppressor. Um, so this will just be a baseline test of standard 22 LR, not subsonic ammo, uh, DB ratings. And without further ado, we'll go ahead and load and make ready. And we'll get testing. This is 22 LR Wildcat ammo. Okay, we are empty and clear. All right guys, so this is the Ruger 1022. I'm gonna be measuring the decibel reading from the muzzle. And this is Wildcat 22 LR. Let's go ahead and shoot five rounds and then we'll see what we get. All right, so the max decibel reading on that was 103. Now let's go ahead and try something else. Okay guys, so the Wildcat ammo we just tested in the 1022 takedown. The max reading we got on that was 103 uh, from the muzzle and from the ear. So not sure how accurate that is. Again, this thing isn't finely tuned, but that at least gave us a baseline. Next ammo we're gonna test unsuppressed is the CCI Suppressor 22 LR. This is a subsonic hollow point, 45 grain, 970 feet per second. So again, we'll test this in the 1022 takedown from the ear and from the muzzle, and we'll see what kind of DB readings we get, and then we'll go on and test the suppressor. Okay, going hot. Okay, so for the next test, I'm gonna be using CCI uh, subsonic. I'm gonna, as again, shoot five rounds and with no suppressor to see how loud it actually is. And I'm gonna be taking it from the muzzle. Dud. Dud.
Interesting. Oh, it's not. It's like a light strike. It's light striking. Okay, so the max on that was 95. I was only able to get three shots off because for whatever reason. Um, but it's safe to say that 95 is the, uh, the max dB reading on the subsonic, which is eight dB less than the um, Wildcat. So we're on to something. Okay guys, so we just shot the CCI uh, subsonic rounds there. Um, now to do a comparison, we're gonna shoot the Winchester Super Suppressed. Uh, this is 40 grain ammo, 1065 feet per second, so still subsonic. And we're gonna test this unsuppressed first, just to get a baseline reading. I'll be loading five rounds, and we'll be taking measurements from the shooter's ear. Going hot. And it looks like a max reading we got on that one was 102. So 102 dB for the subsonic Winchester unsuppressed. So I've got five rounds of Winchester super suppressed on 1022 that's unsuppressed. I'm gonna shoot five rounds and get a reading from the muzzle. Okay, so the max on that was 103. Um, I don't understand why I'm having issues with this right now, but you know, not the first time I've been told I've had issues. So let's keep going. Hey, this is the first test of the suppressor. This is the first few rounds going through this thing. So initially it may be a little bit louder than it'll be after it breaks in, um, but we'll see what happens. This is the CCI subsonic rounds through the 1022 takedown with the dead air mask HD 22. Okay, that's already stupid quiet. Um, I thought the first round that I, I squeezed off was a misfire. Um, I didn't even realize the round came out. So that was actually pretty, that was pretty wicked. Um, the, the reading I got on this, max reading, um, other than me just yapping right now, uh, I think was around like a 92. Uh, it's pretty good. No, it was quieter than that. Pretty good. Yeah, I'll have to go back. We'll go back and we'll check the footage on the sound recorder. So I think it's just picking up my loud ass voice on this thing, um, but we'll see. So, so far, oh yeah, I'm pretty, uh, I'm pretty impressed. Okay, guys, this is the Ruger 1022 takedown with the dead air mask HD 22 suppressor. This time we're using the Winchester uh, Super Silence ammo. This one's a little bit hotter than the CCI, but we'll see DB wise what we get out of this thing. Eighty-three. That's what we got on this this baby. So eighty-three, quieter than my voice is picking up on this thing. That's pretty wild. Uh, so that's whisper quiet. I would say um, that's below the threshold for safe hearing. If you didn't know that, the threshold for safe hearing is eighty-seven dB. So you technically could shoot this thing without ear pro on, and you'd be fine. That's pretty wicked. That's yeah, pretty wicked. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> okay guys, so that was the 1022 test. Now we're going to do the SIG P322. First set of ammo we're going to test is the Winchester Wildcat. Again, I can't shoot this through the suppressor, so we're just going to do an unsuppressed test and see what we get on our meter here. Uh, we did notice some issues with the microphone that we're using on this. It clips out at 110 decibels. So as long as we stay under that, we'll know we have a pretty close measurement, but Tom with his big guns, um, he was definitely clipping out. So let's see what we get with the P322. Going hot. Okay, and as I suspected, we clipped out with the P322. Um, this is a four inch barrel. Uh, so that gas is coming out still pretty hot. Um, clipped at 110. So let's go ahead and test the subsonic ammo now. 
This is the same ammo we used to test on the 1022 takedown. This is the CCI subsonic. Uh, this one is 970 feet per second. So let's test this unsuppressed. Going hot. P322 CCI ammo unsuppressed. Okay, this one we did not clip, so already just shooting the subsonic ammo, we're noticing a reduction in the dB, which is to be expected. Uh, we maxed out at 109 dB. Again, this thing's not super scientifically accurate. It's not calibrated. We're just measuring the reduction of sound when the suppressor's attached. That's really all we're worried about. Next, we'll be testing the Winchester Super Suppress. This one's a little bit hotter uh, at 1,065 feet per second. So we'll be testing this unsuppressed and then we'll suppress it and see what we get. This is the P322 Winchester Super Suppressed Subsonic Ammo. This performed just the same as the CCI. Max DB we got on this is 109. Uh, again, to be expected. I'm actually surprised it didn't clip out. See now this is a little bit of a hotter round. Now we'll throw the suppressor on and we'll see what we get. Okay guys, so we just ran the 1022 takedown test. This thing was pretty quiet with that. Now we're gonna run it in the P322 and we're gonna see if we can get the same result or better on this guy. Uh, first up is the CCI subsonic rounds. And going hot. What's your guess? 87. 79. What the hell? Completely, if this thing is accurate, completely ear safe. You can shoot this thing without your pro on and you'll be fine. Uh, so that's pretty wicked. Um, we're gonna test out the hotter round, the Winchester Super Subsonics, or Supersonic, Super Suppressed, and we'll see how that works out. Crazy part is, is like my voice is louder than the round. Okay, so again, P322, Winchester, super subs. Take a guess. 78. 81. 81. Yeah. So a little bit louder in the CCI, but again, I expected that because it's a little bit of a hotter round. Uh, but overall, man, amazing, amazing performance. Good job, dead air. Um, this thing is fun. Hey guys, thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Hopefully you learned something. If you'd like to see me test something else, be sure to leave a comment in the comment section below. Like and subscribe if you haven't already, and we'll see you all in the next one.